Hey guys, how's it going? So, AABB update, uh, and AABB is starting to do some media presence, some PR, and they made a and they made an official YouTube channel. If you're not aware, so AABB, uh, right now the MACD is all the way at the bottom, uh, RSI is at 47. Uh, th there is a death cross right now. I don't know where the price is gonna go, but if it goes down to 15 cents, I'm gonna be a buyer. I'm gonna buy some more, uh, f some more shares. Uh, there's also the dividend payment, not this week, but next week as the dividend payment. But uh, in order to guarantee your dividend payment, you should buy, you know, either Wednesday or Thursday if you want that dividend. Of, of extra shares it's not it's not that big of a deal but at least it's something so it's up to you what you want to do but I believe they are paying it out on May 5th unless the company decides to push it back another month anything's possible in the markets um, we'll see what happens but I think they're gonna pay out this time we'll see I mean I really don't think that even matters too much to be honest but uh, some people want it so it is what it is uh, and I think this dividend payment is non-dilutive So we'll see uh, just recently they came out with a news they signed the letter of intent to acquire high-grade mineral property in I can't even say that Mexico uh, And recently just not too long ago. They came out with a YouTube channel Asia broadband incorporation already has 333 subscribers they posted four videos of their mine it's they're very short videos, fit between a uh, little bit under a minute. So, you know, check them out if you want to. If you don't want to, then whatever. It doesn't really matter. I've seen three of them. I haven't seen this fourth one. But uh, yeah, so their minds are real. It's a real company. I'm hoping, like I'm hoping that uh, they come out with some PR releases with some somebody actually talking about the company I'm hoping that's going to be the scenario in the future make uh, investors feel more confident about the investment uh, and then and also somebody I think this is not uh, from AABB uh, or Asia broadband I think this is a fan made um, channel and they made an AABBG gold token channel so it says unofficial so it's probably not about the company it's uh, somebody probably made it you know because the 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 fan of AABB uh, Asia broadband and uh, they want to give it more exposure or something so check it out if you want and uh, so I want to go back to this press release that was uh, that was on April 8th which was two weeks ago and in this press release uh, they said that uh, with the upcoming management appointment announcement AABB will sorry uh, is pleased to announce the company's finalized appointment of new management personnel this month as AABB moves forward with development and expansion of mine operations the company requires supervision of Chief Gok uh, did it say in the coming weeks? but it doesn't say in the coming weeks on, the, on, on this press release I said in the coming weeks didn't really read it I just I thought they said it because I thought that's why I thought I read it said but it doesn't really say anything about the coming weeks but but anyways uh, new management oh in the coming weeks so that was two weeks ago uh, so I'm thinking that next week they will announce these new management and hopefully the new management will come on and do press release on the Asia Broadband channel. Hopefully, because we, I want to hear some kind of management start talking about their business, right? Talk, talk, start talking about the channel. And I'm hoping so, for some positive news on this stock. 
Uh, if there is some positive news, I think the stock will explode to the upside. We'll see what happens, uh, but uh, I'm holding on to my shares. Uh, I think that if this thing goes back to 15 cents is a deal, but if this thing goes down to like 10 cents, that is a real deal, like real big deal. But uh, you know, that's just my opinion. At the end of the day, anything's possible, and this thing can go down to a penny. I don't think it will, but anything's possible in this market, so just be aware of that. And I would be a huge bag holder, but I would have. At least a million shares if this thing goes down a penny so or more I don't know I still haven't decided yet but I would be a big buyer down at a penny two pennies definitely but we'll see what happens anyways uh that's all I really have to say in my video um, but uh, you know right now uh, Bitcoin is downtrending uh, Dogecoin is very volatile it's you know it crashed down to twenty thousand, bounced all the way up to almost thirty thirty eight thousand uh, thirty eight cents, and now it's starting to downtrend again or starting to crash again. Uh, the one advantage of holding AABBG tokens right now is no volatility. You your your, your coin stays the same because there's no trading involved and it's backed by gold. So if gold goes down, it goes down. If gold goes up, it goes up, and it's not affected by the whole crypto market as a whole. So that's a little bit of a bonus. But you know, just saying. And Safe Moon right now is um a little red. Uh, just kind of trading. It's down 7.94 percent. It seems like it's kind of following the crypto market. Some people call this a scam. It could be a scam. I don't know if then the day, um, you know, that's the risky part. I think like in general, some people say cryptocurrency as a whole is a scam, but uh, rich people are pouring tons and tons of money into it because you know Dogecoin has a market cap of you know. 32.75 billion dollars. I really don't think retail investors brought the market cap to 32 billion dollars. I think it's billionaires and rich people. And Bitcoin has a market cap of 928 billion dollars, almost a trillion. I don't think that is retail investors that are pumping that the, the, the price that high. I think it's you know, well, it, for sure, it's Tesla and uh, you know. Big corp, big multi-billion dollar corporation buying into Bitcoin. That's the biggest reason why Bitcoin is uh, sitting, even sitting at 40, 49,000. Right now it's kind of downtrending, but uh, we'll see where that goes in the coming weeks. Uh, so anyways, uh, that's all I really have to say in my video. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for future updates and have a great day. Bye.